this is sort of a sideshow to Relationship Mania. This is just Dylan right now. Sam's at school at the moment. And I figured, why not see how far I can get in every Souls game without dying? This is inspired by Eagle Raptor doing Mega Man X with the Buster only. This should be a, a hell of a time. Starting with Demon Souls, I still haven't even beaten this game. And I know I'm going to die very, very fast. A few rules to this is that I am still allowed to play online for whoever's playing online in Demon Souls anymore. Um, I am still allowed to level up. I'm allowed to change my armor. I'm. It's just as far as I can get without dying. So. I haven't even beaten Demon Souls yet, so I'm going to die fairly fast in this and then get on to what I consider the better Souls games. Sorry to anybody who likes Demon Souls more. I was never that big a fan of it. I think Dark Souls 1 is probably my favorite. That doesn't mean I won't die in that one though. Alright, character name, uh, just call you Cosmo. Male, uh, let's see, what class do I want? Knight, Hunter, a Soldier. Priest, Magician, Wanderer. Wanderers fairly evened out. Hmm. I think Temple Knight is what I went with with my other one. Yeah, I'll go with Temple Knight. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valarfax of the Royal Twin Fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. Ooh. That the old King Alant had aroused the Old One, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls also lose their minds. The mad attack the sane, and chaos reigns. Valarfax spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors were drawn to the accursed land. But none have returned. Bjor of the Twin Fangs. Yurt the Silent Chief. Sage Urbane. Skurver the Wanderer. The sixth saint Astraea and her knight Garo Vinland. And sage Frake the visionary. 
The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? You tell me. Anyways, um... Sorry that opening monologue was so long. Um, because of that, I guess I'll extend this episode a little bit longer. Another thing. I'm going to die at this tutorial boss Brave because I've never beaten it before. Not I'm not counting it because I don't want to end the series so soon. I shall guide you. For really the challenge will begin once I enter the Nexus. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. All right, gotta put Grandpa to sleep. Gotcha. Hmm, what's my equipment here? Did it? All right. Ooh, sound delay on my recording is going to mess with me there. Oh, hi. Not a fan of the heavy rolling. Oh wait, no, that's later. Thought the ball was going down the stairs, but that's not until you. Use an item. Don't need to. Not yet, at least. Thank you for more healing items, though. Backstab! I don't understand how you stab. Oh, well. Never mind, there is a. Woohoo! die. Should be fun. So the said, I don't remember if From Software actually helped with this game since it said Atlas. But I think Atlas only published this one. Also, I'm a huge fan of Atlas games. 
Well, not a huge fan. I like Persona a lot. And there's some other games I like too, which are slipping my mind right now. Um, Digital Devil Saga, um, Devil Survivor. They're great games. Oh, hello, Blue Knight. Blue Eyed Knight. I just. You're not Blue Knight. Nope. 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 Once I reach the Nexus, um, I'll most likely end the episode there. Don't want to end the episode right now, obviously. Nothing's happened. Oh, parry. Or, I mean, shield break. Hitting forward in R1 at the same time does this, and sometimes in the middle of combat you... You hit those two buttons at the same time. It's kind of annoying. And it happens in, I think, every Dark Souls game. I just hold forward and go to attack, and I wind up kicking. Yeah. Oh, Jesus. There he is. Get out of here. Hey. So, I have a feeling I can most likely maybe make it to Phalanx, beat him. And I think when I reach the Stone Fang Tunnel, that's when I'll die. Dark Souls 1, uh, most likely make it to the Taurus Demon. I always seem to have bad luck to, like, roll off the edge with him because of the lock-on failure. Oh, Jesus. I'm so good at video games. No jumping in Demon Souls? There isn't. Well then. Oh, there's no reason to go over there anyway. Also, when I say that I like Dark Souls more than this game, it's not that this game's bad or anything. It is good. I just suck at it. It's a lot harder, too. Mostly because, you know, it's their first attempt at this kind of game. They wouldn't have the difficulty be easy. Alright. Let's see if I can beat this guy. I have a feeling not. Yep. Jesus. Yeah, I died. <laughs> Might have been a better idea if I took off my armor there and just dodge rolled like my life depended on it because <laughs> it's slow rolling is what killed me for sure I do like the Nexus, though, as a central hub.
let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Thanks, lady. Brought me to the Nexus, which I can't leave until I get all of the demon souls or... This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Boletaria. Boletaria. Thou canst not exit the Nexus, but each of the five archstones will connect it to the What? You have died and the Nexus has trapped your soul. You cannot escape the Nexus. However, by capturing demon souls, you can reclaim your physical body. Alrighty. Cool. Next fuel binding. Alright, on the next episode, we're gonna talk to this gentleman right here and then head for this archstone. See y'all there.